How you guys doing? Thank you for joining us here on SB252. So the Carolina Panthers owner, Jerry Richardson, will be selling the team now because of all the latest allegations that have been coming in. He's done inappropriate stuff with female workers on the team. He said racial comments, and he tried to pay them hush money in order to shut up so he wouldn't get caught for what he allegedly did. Of course, these are all allegations. The NFL is investigating them right now. We don't know if they're true or not. The whole evidence hasn't come out. And obviously, Jerry Richardson is the founder of the Panthers, has been their owner since 1995. He founded the team. He used to play for the Colts when they played in Baltimore. And he actually owned some restaurants, which was, which was why he was able to become a billionaire. And now these allegations are one of the latest in America, which has been a sad trend lately, specifically with sexual abuse. Yeah, it, it's gotten real bad. I can say that. And it's really unfortunate if these allegations are really true. But at the same time, it's really hard to see why an individual, at least if some, why we would sell his team at all if it wasn't true. At least to some degree, accurate information. Well, this reminds me a little bit of Donald Sterling or the Atlanta Hawks owner. I remember when Donald Sterling sent some insensitive comments mm -hmm. about um, black people coming to the games. Remember whenever um, the Atlanta Hawks owner said some stupid comments in an email a few years back and both of them sold their team. Donald Sterling was forced. The Atlanta yeah. owner, the Hawks owner, was not forced like Jerry Richardson. Yeah. But like you said, that him selling the team does show it may be some merit to some of these allegations at least being partially true because it's hard for a man who's owned the team for so long to just give up a team like that. In a sense, it's almost like an admission of guilt. Now, I'm not, I'm not saying he did anything, but I will say this. Cam Newton came into the league a few years ago, and he put a strict dress code on Cam Newton, and he also said he wasn't allowed to get any piercings or body tattoos. Now, I haven't seen him do that to any other player. Now, Obviously, I'm putting into question, was that a racial, was that for racial reasons? Ultimately, we can't know. Jerry Richardson, if you were to look him in the eye, he would say no. But it would seem to be as if it was. You know, and he also put a bad name on Steve Smith Sr. Whenever he left, put him out to be such a villain, you know. And I, I haven't seen him do the same thing to players who were not African American uh, descent. I haven't seen that out of Mr. Jerry Richardson. You know, so I, we don't know. Like I said, we don't know. But these are things that lead to lead me to believe and lead us to believe that these allegations are accurate. And on, honestly, over the past, past few years, there have been a lot of people who have speculated about this owner. Now, of course, now all this is coming out. And a lot of people are trying to say, oh, now that all that has come out, somehow that this justifies that back then, somehow it makes it accurate as well. But it doesn't necessarily. So that's why we're trying to stay neutral and say, you know, give the man a chance. He might be mm -hmm. selling the team. Maybe he just doesn't want to deal with it anymore. Maybe he's up there in age and he doesn't want to deal with these type of accusations. But I'll tell you what, especially what he did with those women were real inappropriate. And yeah, some we, for a mixed audience, especially with children watching, we don't want to say. Yeah, we don't want to say everything that everything that he allegedly did, if it really is true, because it's just that bad. You know, and it it's really a bad look. And this is really true. This is really bad for the NFL. This is a bad look. It, this is bad. Just an NFL league that has been going down in the ratings because of a lot of different reasons. This definitely will not help at all. Anyway, we appreciate you guys watching here on SB252. We want to know what you guys think about this in the comments below. Big news story. Talk to you guys later.